Today we'll be making a spiral snake with materials you may have at home. You will need either a paper plate, piece of paper, or a folder, scissors, string such as fishing line, ribbon, or yarn, tape, and ways to decorate such as markers and crayons. Optionally, you can use paint. Start by choosing your background material. If you choose paper or a folder, trace it and cut it out. I'll be using a paper plate. Decide if you want to decorate before or after you cut out your snake. If you are using paint, it can be easier to paint the plates before you cut it out. This is a great choice if you're not worried about creating a detailed pattern. For this example, I'll use paint on the bottom and I'll draw on the top. Next, draw your snake on the plate. If you start by drawing the head in the middle and work your way outwards, when you're all done, the head will be at the top and the tail will hang downwards. If you draw the head of the snake on the outside, it will hang downwards, suspended by the tail. It's up to you. Now it's time to decorate. You can draw a pattern, pictures, words, a message, whatever you like. For this snake, I'll draw a pattern using the letter S because the word snake starts with an S. After that, color it in and don't forget the back. Next, follow the guidelines and cut it out. Now let's add a tongue. You can cut out a tongue with a separate piece of paper or you can cut off the end of the tail and cut it into the shape of a snake's tongue and then decorate it and tape it onto the back. Now let's add the string. I'll be using a piece of fishing line, but you can use whatever type of string you like. Take your string, add some tape, and then tape it to the back of the snake's head so that the string comes out right between the head and the body. Congratulations, you have a spiral snake. <laughs>